If you don't know us, my name's Zach Dingy. Tony Capaletti. I'm an entrepreneur. I run a solar team. I'm an entrepreneur as well and an amputee and very handsome and tall. We're called <laughs> we're called the Two Dudes Three Legs Podcast because Tony has lost his leg in a car accident within the last two years. It's a motorcycle accident. Same shit. <laughs> Tony. <laughs> Tony. <laughs> Perfect. We Let's actually have no way. idea why we're here. <laughs> Let's Who do it are that we? Way. Recently, we have teamed up with Giveability and Levitate Blade Legs. Why don't you tell us a little bit about what that is? So it started off when I was introduced to Lassie Madsen, the founder of Levitate Blade Legs, who has an incredible story. Uh, and we plan to have him on the podcast as well. But I can't even remember how we started speaking. Uh, but he told me he had somebody he wanted to introduce me to, a gentleman by the name of Michael Derringer, who owns Giveability. It's a 5013C nonprofit corporation. And what they do is they raise funds for any type of adaptive athlete. And if you don't know what an adaptive athlete, it's it could be an amputee or somebody that needs special equipment to engage in the sport or activity that they're engaging in. They will find good candidates in need of adaptive sports equipment and they will get the funding for them without the people knowing, and then they will surprise them by giving it to them. So it's a little different than other charitable organizations where they have that, that factor of surprise built in, and they also like to keep the donors engaged. Another way they bridge that gap is by appointing ambassadors. So I've been chosen to become an ambassador for giveability. Uh, very grateful to do that. It, you know, it, it's amazing to be able to give the gift of ability back to someone else. I will never forget the day I went to Prosthetic and Orthotic Associates, which is my prosthetic office, and they had a blade leg for me to try out. It was like Christmas morning when I was eight years old. I'll never forget it. I was running around like a little kid. It felt amazing. Having the ability to give that feeling back to someone else is going to be extremely impactful in my life. And I think it'll do amazing things for our podcast as well. And it very well coincides with what we want to do as far as bringing a positive message and working with other entrepreneurs to give back to a community that needs it. And here's what Levitate is all about. Levitate Blade Legs are for people who amputees currently right now they just offer leg prosthetics they're for para athletes and the biggest thing about levitate is they disrupted the industry what makes them special is instead of having to go through insurance and having to go through all the complications of trying to get a blade leg and if people don't know the short version is it's very difficult to get a blade leg your insurance will cover your leg if you lose it to be able to walk and and, and a normal prosthetic but you can't get a running prosthetic. You're able to buy a prosthetic for $2,000. And just to speak to how complicated it is, anytime I spoke to someone, you know, months before I knew what Levitate was about getting a blade leg, yep. the first thing they would always tell me is go online and try to get grants or get funding for <laughs> and it. And what was the That's average how cost? how expensive. I never even made it that far. Right. What we've done is partner with Giveability to give Levitate blade legs to people. In just 24 hours, my... Solar sales team raised $11,000 and we have already five legs that we're going to be given out. We've already given out our first leg. We're going to a live event in Colorado on December 11th to hand out the rest of the legs to the candidates. The Levitate test run at Barwis Gym. Yep. And we're going to be sharing that obviously on the podcast coming soon in the clips of, and all the candidates that are getting legs I can't uh, wait from our that. fundraiser. But our goal is to raise $20,000. We've already done 11000 in just 24 hours and... I want to share why this is super special to us specifically. Lassie Madsen, the owner of Levitate, lost his leg and decided to go out and become an entrepreneur and to make his own blade legs because he was struggling to find it. Another way that he is disrupting the market with blade legs is he's offering these products direct to consumer, which is not something you're going to find in the United States. And I can't speak for overseas, uh, but I assume it's the same way over there. But he has bridged that gap for us and why this is important again specifically for two dudes three legs channel we're both entrepreneurs and we believe tony's a survivor the people who are getting these blade legs are survivors oftentimes entrepreneurs and survivors can kind of go hand in hand and since the day we started this podcast i've always said that i want to i want to be able to give back to some foundation or some charity that relates deeply to us 
And I think this couldn't be any better entrepreneur who's disrupted a market, who's created blade legs for people who otherwise couldn't get those legs. We're super excited to have partnered up with Giveability and Levitate. We're very excited to take you guys along this journey and see how far we can go and how large of an impact we can make. I'm strongly going to encourage everyone to continue donating. If you know someone in need, maybe put them in contact with us. We need more money. <laughs> the link will be attached below for you to click on it and donate. It's for a great cause. These are great people. And the event is going to be on December 11th. We're going to have many different videos coming out until then. So if you want to follow the journey, feel free to subscribe to the Two Dudes, Three Legs channel. Follow us on Instagram at Two Dudes, Three Legs. And if you want to follow my journey or Tony's journey, I'm Z Dingy Solar on Instagram and TikTok. And I'm Anthony Capaletti, baby. At one point in my life, I was on the receiving end of donations. Um, that changed my life. And I am every day, I am so grateful for what the people around me have done for me. Uh, my life would not have been the same or okay if I didn't receive the charity that I did when I was in need. And now I'm on a mission to give back because I feel that that's only fair. Bars. Bars. We're calling on the Two Dudes, Three Legs Army to help us share this yeah. message. And I don't mean click and share. I mean talk to people about it. Get the word going around because the only way we can raise more money is with the attention of people who don't know about this yet. So if you can't give money, give a little bit of time and just share the message. All we want to do is help people and give back. You never know when you need a leg. And you might need it. <laughs> <laughs>